Hello everybody, welcome back to my studio of Perpetual Mojo. You know, I've always been fascinated with Romani Gypsies and their outward expression of life. It may not be the most glamorous life in the world, but they own their space with rich colors and designs. And I just need a little bit of that in my life right now. The foundation for my bracelets is coffee cup rims. And they're actually pretty strong. So you want to cut it out and keep the circle intact. Save your cup for another day and another project. Now I've cut a one inch strip that's 18 inches long. I'm going to start wrapping a little bit at an angle, adding glue as I need it. For some of the thicker ones you'll want to go around two or maybe even three times. If you run out of fabric just go cut some more. Easy peasy. Stop every once in a while and I am wrapping fairly tightly I think. I've gone all the way around and I could continue to wrap that but I don't want there to be a wide spot and also I want as much of the orange to show as I can get so I'm going to trim that and put just a little bit of glue glue it down into place just like that now for the decoration part I have 20 gauge copper and I have some six inch pieces and here's how we're gonna do this just make a small coil at either end. You can make it as small or elaborate as you want. That looks pretty good. Do one on the other end. Now you're going to take one of your spirals and you're going to hold it down onto the bracelet. Right out on the edge and then you're going to wrap it around as many times as you like. You can stretch it out or keep it compact. And you'll notice that I have some loose threads here from the edge of the fabric. I just really like the way that looks. But you don't have to have yours that way. And finish it up. Okay, now I want for this to face the other way. So I just flipped it over and I want this to be level with the other end. And there you have it. Let's do another one. Now you want to look at the edge of the one that you did first. This was on this side. And you want to face the coil for the next one the same way. And I left about a half inch between each. And it's going to look like that. Now on some of these, this one I did three times around. And the wires were plenty long. The wires were at least as long as this. But I only went around a couple of times because it's so much bigger. And that looks pretty cool. And then on the thinner ones, I did a few different sizes, and when they're all together, they're just going to look heavenly. This is a really quick and easy way to bring a little bit of oomph of gypsy color into your life, a little bit of excitement. The only thing that's missing for me is a jingle. I might have to jingle these up a little. I hope that you're inspired to try something like this. I hope that if you do, you will share it with us. Email me, Candace at CoolToCraft.com with your high resolution photos and your story so I can get it posted on our creative community blog. I'm Candace, and I think it's so cool to craft. <laughs>